to create a custom icon from scratch, open an image editor and set the size to 512 pixels by 512 pixels. Then go ahead and create the image however you'd like. I have an image representing a database so I can create a custom icon for my SQL files which default to a blank file icon in OSX. Once the image has been created, we're going to save it as a PNG to save the transparency attributes of the image. And then we will open that image in Icon Composer, which is found in the development tools that it's free to download from Apple. It's found in the Utilities folder inside the developer tools. Once we've opened Icon Composer, we're going to drag our custom PNG image into Icon Composer and copy it to all the smaller sizes. This creates all the different sized icon files that we need and now we just need to save it. So we'll do file, save, and tell it where to save it and how to name it. Now the ICNS file needs to be converted over to a resource file in order to drag it into the info pane to change it. So we have a program that's available online for free called ICNS to Resource. Just Google it and you'll find it. The guys who created it are pretty cool. Then we'll open our icon image, icon file, and it will ask us where we want to save the resource file. Then we just open the information pane on the file or application that we want to change the icon for and drag it over into the top left corner where the image is and the icon changes. And that's it, there you have it. To copy an icon from another file or application that already exists is quite simple. All we need to do is open the information panes for both the files that we want to get the icon from and move the icon to. Click on the icon, do an apple copy and then an apple paste on the other icon and it will copy it over. Another way to do this is to drag the preview image up into the icon area of the folder or file we want to change. A third way to do it is to drag it from the top of the window over into the same spot and it converts it over. So as to where the icons are kept in applications, right click on the application, show package contents, and then go into the resources folder and you will find all of the icon images for the program. So you just want to modify an icon that already exists so it looks a little bit different. All you need to do is show package contents on an application, go into contents and resources, find the file that you want to change the icon for, and then open up your favorite image editor. I'll use Acorn and set the size to 512 by 512 pixels and then I'll just drag the preview over into the image editor. Once it's been dragged into the image editor, I can edit that, save it, and go through the process of converting it over to an icon. 